In this video, we're going to discuss during the winter, can you use 120 volts AC to not only charge the car, but keep it happy during the winter outside? The sun is going down. The weather report reports it's going to be 20 degrees tonight. I've hooked up the Model Y to 120 volts AC, and you see we're plugged in. So the experiment tonight will be, it's supposed to be 20 degrees Fahrenheit. Let's have a look at the state of charge and let's see if this will continue to charge all night and see how it works overnight. The mobile connector is connected and the indication says we are charging the car. Let's have a look inside and see what the internal display looks like. The current state of charge is 180 miles. We're charging currently at 115 volts AC. I've got 10 amps of current and it's showing uh, 3 miles per hour of charge. The current temperature is 37 degrees Fahrenheit. So let's let this charge all night. I'll check it in the morning. The car reports 18 hours and 50 minutes to get to the 90% mark. We'll see how that works tomorrow as well. So let's hit the rack and check back in the morning. Good morning. Currently it's 6.50 a.m. This car here, the Model Y, has been sitting out since last night about 6 p.m. Now I haven't pre-warmed it because I have no intention to drive it, but let's take a look. I know you guys from Canada are going, yeah, yeah. Well, we're up here in Wyoming, and you can see the Model Y has frosted over pretty well. I haven't left the sentry mode on. That's been off. And you can see we're pretty frozen. I don't know. Oh, well, the handles don't seem to care. But... It's dirty. It's a dirt road. It's the way it is. It's frosty, but it's not that cold in terms. Oh, well, look. Since I moved that handle, look what it's showing. 13 hours to charge. We're at 217 miles of range. It's charging at 3 miles per hour. We've gained 39 miles since I plugged it in. It's still 10 amps. It's 113 volts. So I don't need to get in it because that's what we were going to look at when we were inside. The app reports 22 degrees inside. And just for the record, let's see. Does this work? Let me back this off. Okay. Oh, handles aren't frozen. There's not enough moisture here. This is just residual moisture so no problem i don't see uh any issue to charge it on 120 volts ac and i think we've proven now that it's very possible to do that at least this temperature we're gaining a good charge 39 miles of range overnight at 120 volts ac so there you have it this is a little interesting you notice that frost on a lot of areas. You notice the charge cord, but you notice it's not here. So there must be a, a minute amount of energy generated from the charge port electronics that uh, keep it warm. And I think uh, it's supposed to do that. Kind of interesting. There's another thing we should look at. Let's see here if I can see it. The frameless windows. I don't think it's that cold. Normally the frameless windows uh, come down to clear the, uh, the trim, should you do need to open it, but I don't think it's reached that magic temperature where it would come down. Maybe it's 20 degrees Fahrenheit or something, I don't know. Anyway, all is well. So I think this concludes today's video. I think we've proved that charging on 120 volts AC, as small as that is, allows the car to charge in cold weather. And I think you can feel comfortable if this is the amount of charge you're gonna be doing 
uh, you can charge your car. Albeit kind of slow, it's okay. If you're not going anywhere, it solves the problem. If you like this video, go ahead and click the like, subscribe, and don't forget to click the bell icon for upcoming videos. If you'd like to buy yourself a Tesla, of course, the referral link shown here at the bottom of the screen gets you 1,000 miles or 1,500 kilometers of free supercharging. Thanks for watching. I'll look for you again. Take care.